42. For the second year, USO San Diego is the beneficiary of holiday events sponsored by the Hilton San Diego Bayfront. So, hello, Holiday by the Bay. Oh, yeah. Lauren Stewart is the CEO of USO San Diego. Good morning, Lauren. Happy holidays. Good morning, uh, LaDonna and Ted. All hey right. there. So you too. Tell us about Holiday by the Bay. Oh, this is just great. You know, to have a partner like the Hilton uh, San Diego Bayfront to uh, put this big event on downtown, uh, down by the by the bay. It has uh, a two-story, 100-foot ice tubing slide. It's got iceberg bumper cars. They've got snow flurries every night. Uh, we have a, a light show there, 30-foot tall Christmas tree to get in the spirit. And, of course, they have a lot of things for the kids, like gingerbread decorating and also the adult kids. They have cocktail lounges and things like that. And it's just great. A, a dollar of every entrance ticket goes right to USO San Diego to help us support our active duty military and families here in San Diego during the holidays. And how do you support them? What's the scope of what you do? You know, we do we do so much. Family resiliency is a very big part. Our, our military, as you know, is a very big part of our community here. We have over 110,000 active duty military. And for those enlisted families that come to San Diego from different parts, they find themselves here, maybe, you know, a one family, uh, a one income family with a number of children, and then they get deployed. We, the USO, have been around since uh, 1941, and we try to strengthen the military by providing a home away from home and trying to really help combine the services here. Um, this year right now we're going through, actually this is the last day of our toy drive. Uh, last year we gave out 7,200 toys to deserving military family children. Uh, last year we helped 220,000 people in San Diego alone. Um, and we also served over 32,000 free meals. And we don't get any uh, federal funding. We only depend upon the generosity of the community here in San Diego. It's a great community. And um, I, it just makes that life a little bit better for those who are helping us, uh, you know, to keep us safe and secure at home. So the holiday events that are that are sponsored by Hilton on the Bayfront um, and Holiday by the Bay probably go a long way to helping you do those things. They really do. You know, LaDonna, it, 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 we just can't do it on our own. And, and times are tough. I mean, you know, you watch the market and you see all the things. It's kind of a little expensive to live in San Diego as well, so every dollar really helps our, um, our our active duty military. We have a very small staff. For everything we've done, we've got 12 full-time staff. That's it, to do four locations and serve 200,000 people a year. So um, we, we depend upon those donations. We also depend upon our volunteers. We had over 52,000 hours of volunteer service last year from our community as well. We're really a volunteer organization. And are there are a lot of different ways we can give. How, how can we give? You know, thanks so much, Ted. That's really important. Uh, we are a local chapter. We've been here since 1941, 78 years almost, coming up in 2019. And if you go to our website, that's important. A lot of people will hear us or see us. We've been out in the media a lot. And I'll have people come up and say, hey, Lauren, we gave you something. They went to USO. USO is the national organization back in D.C. This is, We're a chapter of them. But to keep it local, you want to go to the website is the best way. USO, www.usosandiego.org. There's a donate button. Obviously, all cash donations are tax deductible. Um, and they'll also show you how you can volunteer. And we also are still collecting toys uh, through today at different locations. Uh, it will tell you on the website. Right now, I think we're picking up from Geppetto's and the Jersey Mike's in town. We've been promoting this all month. Uh, but right now, even if those bins are gone, you can come down to Liberty Station. Our headquarters has moved to 2790 uh, Truxton Road, right there in the heart of, uh, of Liberty Station. Well, the USO does so much, and you guys do it with donations only. Um, you don't take any state or federal funding or anything like that, do you? Nope, not at all. And a lot of, I think because the branding is so good for so long, a lot of people misunderstand or, or, or just think automatically assume that USO is, uh, you know, part of the government or receives federal funding or state funding. And, and we just don't. It's, uh, it's all a nonprofit. And that actually goes way back to 1941 when Roosevelt uh, wanted to get us through char a charter through Congress. Uh, there were, you know, six different nonprofits. Uh, that were all very famous. They're still around today. They all had a military support group, and Roosevelt said, why don't we just focus on all the military side rather than competing? Let's do one, you know, unite everyone's organization and try to help the military by getting together and doing that. And that's how the United Service Organizations was started, the USO. We started back then that way. All right, Lauren Stewart, CEO of USO San Diego, talking about Holiday by the Bay. Thank you, Lauren, so much. 
Thank you. Really appreciate the spotlight on USO San Diego. Have a great holiday, and thank you, everybody, for your support. All right. Here are the stories trending in San Diego.